Clark is eating breakfast, checking the schedule for today. If you're wondering what that sound is, that is our washing machine upstairs doing its final thing. Uh, but today we just have a live lesson at 9.30. And then Clark doesn't have a thing again until two. So today we're gonna to be going out and about. He's already made a request for lunch out today. Where are we having it, Clark, man? Taco Bell. Taco Bell is where lunch is happening today, but I also have to go to Best Buy to buy something and I'll show you what that is. Down here in our basement, I've had this dream of converting my Lego studio, which is what you see behind me here, and kind of scaling that back into making this space more of a livable space for my family and being able to enjoy other things other than staring at Lego sets that are sitting on shelves. And I've made some moves to make that happen. People that lived here before us, they had sort of a home theater system down here and I decided that I would bring that back. So I replaced their projector they had, which is 1080p with this 4K projector by Optima that I absolutely love. In addition to that, I also put in a brand new 100 inch screen to watch that on. You guys also know that I have the PS5 now that I'm using for putting content onto that. And the one other component that I was using that was previously here was this receiver. And I was just gonna keep this because I thought it was pretty nice, but it's actually creating a bit of a problem for me. And that's because this is 4K, this is 4K, but this is 1080p. So when those lines cross, my signal from this, which should be 4K and looking awesome, gets converted down to 1080p because of this. So this has to go. So if you're still following the story here and you're wondering, Greg, why don't you just eliminate this and not use it? Well, that is in control of all of the audio that we're getting from all these speakers that you see around here. There's five of them and a subwoofer back behind here. Without that, the only audio that I would have is the tiny little speaker that's up in that projector, which is no, 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 not so good. So this thing, needs replaced and that's what we're doing today. We're going to Best Buy to buy a Sony version of this. This is Yamaha and I thought it was like an expensive unit, but it turns out you can get one of these for like $85 right now because it's a little bit old, obviously it's outdated. It doesn't have the technology that you need for the other things I'm trying to do. And I want the best quality that I can get because this is close as I'm getting to going to a movie theater this year probably. When Clark's done with class, we're gonna run to Best Buy, we're gonna get that new receiver, we're gonna set that up and then hopefully I'll have 4K content that I can stream and play video games on down here. And of course, we're going out for lunch too, as we previously mentioned, because that is like his request. Friday's become like the day of, of like reward for a week. Well done, work well done, hard deserved, hard earned, whatever it is, we're going out today and we're having fun. Still learning 10 today. Still, All right, let's keep it's going. been a week of 10s. Mm. Ten, 10, we're, ten. we're on top of 10. There's probably no one that cares, but this is the receiver that I'm planning to buy. And I found this interesting because I was going to pick it up and have it ready for store pickup. But this says, your order will be brought out to your car using Best Buy curbside pickup. Never done that before. I guess today will be the first time. Counting up from two, which number comes next? Hey, he got it. Clark man just finished math and I just finished shooting a Lego haul video on a set that we just got in the mail. This is the police station and we got this cute little car here. We're giving this away actually. This we're gonna start building tonight during our patron stream and I'm excited about that. And Clark is spinning a top. <laughs> Guess how much love I have on you. How much? So much, the bench broke. Oh, oh he loves me. <laughs> oh, thanks bubs. Thanks, bubs. Clark finished all of his school stuff and now uh, he's trying to get into his Mandalorian costume, but we can't because we gotta go. We gotta go get the thing and then we gotta go get some lunch. Or we can just skip the lunch if you want to. Let's just skip the lunch. We'll just. No, no. Let's get Taco Bell. Hey, Dad, I feel like Taco Bell would be like we eat bells. <laughs> Don't. I'm excited about that, actually. I wish I could try out my brand new boots. Oh, yeah. Oh, you guys want to see Clark Mann's new boots that he got for the snow. He no longer has to wear rain boots outside. We're moving up in the world. These are North Face. What? These were probably way too expensive. I'm going to have to talk to your mom about this because you'll be grown out of these by the time you wear them again, probably. Ow! Ah! <laughs> Get him, Roxy. Get him, tell him. Go ahead, boo. We've got lots of time. It's like 1130. We don't have to be back until 2 o'clock, so it should be a pretty casual situation here and uh, we'll get the stuff and we'll come home and eat. We are on the road with Clark Man. What's happening back there, Clark Man? You gonna stay awake until we get to Best Buy? We'll see. Good morning, sunshine. Look where we're at. I, I think we're awake the whole time. Yeah, okay. I was just pretending I was sleeping. Just pretending? Uh, yeah, so you would laugh at me. Oh, I was laughing. Were you belly laughing? Big time. 
curbside pickup. Hey, we got the best spot in the lot right here, Clark, man. Should be parking over there for the curbside, but I decided that we're actually gonna go in because I'm thinking about upgrading my gaming headset. I'm not happy with the one that I have, and I've been doing enough research, I think, to get one of the best wired headsets, and it's not that much money, and they have it in stock here. So it seems like a triple win. So let's go in, Shark Boy, and let's pick up our stuff. I haven't been to Best Buy in forever. Yeah. Kind of exciting, huh? Mm -hmm. The world of Best Buy. Oh, they got a little bit of toys here. Nice. And some Funkos. Oh yeah, that's the one I'm looking for. The best gaming headset on PlayStation. Is this the only PS5 game that they have here? <laughs> Everything else is PS4 as far as I can tell. Here's all the Switch stuff. Hey, this is what we're looking for, Clark. Man, this is it. $100. Supposed to be an amazing headset, though. Leaving Best Buy, that was a pretty simple process. Got my headset, got my receiver. I'll show it to you here in the car. You guys already saw this. This is the Razer Black Shark V2, which supposedly is the best wired headset that I could possibly buy. $100. Not bad for that. Take my information off here so you guys can see this. S. TRDH590 receiver. This is what the back of it looks like. We're gonna get into that 4K life, baby. I'm excited. I'm excited too. You are? Uh-huh. Yeah, man. Now that Best Buy is conquered, we move on to the next part of our mission, which is Clark's favorite part, and that's the Taco Bell. Taco Bell. Dong. Oh my goodness, Clark, man. What? We got a bit of a line here, boys. Oh no, some tacos are in our way. I think they're serving up some tacos today. Hey, I gotta show you guys something though. We're actually gonna be eating here for free today thanks to Jenny from Patreon. She sent us a $25 Taco Bell gift card. So now we can have a couple lunches here because $25 goes pretty far at Taco Bell. Oh, we're creeping. I was gonna get a quesarito, but they have this $5, uh, what was it, nacho fries box? And it's actually a really good deal. You get a, a burrito, you get these nacho fries, you get a taco and a drink for $5. And the quesarito was $3.89, so it's like, dang. So we're only gonna be in this like, maybe like 12 bucks or something like that. And uh, we can if come we back again. Stuff, I'm gonna have those fries too. Yeah, I'm, absolutely. I'm gonna share my whole meal with you, ma'am. This is our second time coming to Taco Bell. I haven't been here prior to our last time, which was actually really fun. I haven't been to Taco Bell in probably like four years, maybe. Last time was when I was still working. So it had to be before 2017. I think it was 100 years. 100 years ago was the last time I was at Taco Bell. It was just a, just a dirt hut over here that I ate out of. <laughs> there he is. It's kind of cool, eh? Ooh. Yeah. I, I'll give it to you when it's time. Okay, you want it? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. I see um, a hand right there holding it. Mm -hmm. Oh, we're getting there, Clark, man. This, this is going way faster than Burger King. I need to get a mount for our car so I can have my camera set up. I kind of like this shot. We could always just be like doing little podcasts from here. Welcome everyone back to the Greg and Clark sit in the drive through podcast. Today I'm Greg and with me is my co-host Clark man. He doesn't talk much. We're, we're moving forward again. I think we're up. Uh, Hi, could I get a $5 nacho fries box? And a drink? Could I do the Baja Blast Mountain Dew? And could I also get three uh, Doritos Locos Tacos, just plain? Uh, I would be eleven thirty-one. Okay, thank you. Eleven dollars and thirty-one cents. That's not even half of what's on this card. Jenny, if you're watching, hopefully you are. Thank you, Jenny. Jenny also gave us this as well. We have a Arby's gift card for twenty-five dollars. So now you know where we're going to be eating at here in the future. Clark's trying to plan out next week already. He's a madman. Next week is going to be Wendy's. There's the Olive Garden, Clark, ma'am. Olives. We haven't eaten there in a long Have time. Have you ate olives before that? Yeah, I like olives, actually. Have you ate gardens? Mm, yeah, I've eaten food out of a garden. Well, a garden is... Well, do olives grow on the ground? They actually grow on, like, a bush. No, they should grow like on a the tree. Bush. They should grow on the ground because olive garden. <laughs> Hello. Hi, how are you? Good. I have a gift card. Do I just, swipe? just swipe it right on the side? Flip it around. Okay. Yeah. Oops. Sorry about that. You're fine. Didn't mean to stab you in the hand. It's okay. <laughs> Let me see that for you. Huh? Oh sure. Let's 
Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, I appreciate it. Okay. You too. Take care. Okay. Bye bye. She saw you. I'm like, what good nice. customer service there. Uh -huh. Holy moly. She's so nice. Yeah, I love it when you get good people like that. Okay. It just, it, make, it makes I, you feel good. I was to you, really oh. you guys just died. Sorry guys, this smells so good. <laughs> hey, boo hey. You guys got Taco Bell. Dun, 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 dun. He eats it. <laughs> he eats the bag. <laughs> Is this our thumbnail? Uh-huh. We're a little crazy today. Taco Bell gets us excited. So we're gonna start with, I guess, Parkman's. Just rip right into that. These are gonna be your three tacos in there, buddy. You want me to grab one for you? Mm -hmm. My tacos are coming out, boys. There you I go. ordered three of them. And How can one kid eat three tacos? So this is what they look like. The taco with nothing else on it other than just meat inside of a Dorito shell. Mm -hmm. It's called a Doritos. Locos, his favorite thing from Taco Bell. He has three of those in here, but mine, mine's a little bit different. Mine's got some fancy pants stuff going on here. Really, Rex? Hope you guys are ready for this. Because inside here, here are the nacho fries. Got the nacho fries box, this is $5. Includes nacho fries and nacho cheese for the fries, which is still hot, even after driving home. Mm. We got just a regular taco in here. And I'll show you. This is what a taco looks like when they actually put toppings on it. So it looks a little fuller than what the Clark's Doritos one does. And we also got probably my favorite thing. This is a, I think a beef burrito that's inside here. Beef burrito. Beef burrito that I'm looking forward to eating if the Me too. The paper like doesn't stick to it. You can't see much of that, but I'm gonna take a bite of this and we'll show you what the inside looks like. Going in. Don't bite paper. Mm -mm. That'd be bad. Mmm. Mmm. No mm. shot. That's good. I already ate my taco. Mm. Wow, that's really good. Clark's gonna try my burrito. Mm. Thumbs up from Clark, man. Mm -hmm. Taco Bell. <laughs> I'm gonna put that aside for just a moment to try the nacho fries. We'll see how these are. I tried one plain. Thoughts? Tastes like Doritos. Oh, is that what it is? Mm -hmm. They just put Doritos on the outside of a french fry? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Yeah, these are like just like seasoned fries, really. With like Dorito, like if you ate a bag of Doritos and had all the chips out of it, but all that was left was like the powder and crumbs at the bottom, and then you mix that with French fries. That's what these are like. Dad. Yeah. I'm all the way on the top of the shelf. Wow. Glad we ordered three of those. You mad man? We also have ourselves a Baja Blast Mountain Dew here, which I'm. Curious for I mean, I can try it. Clark to try it. Yeah, this is some good stuff. It's probably my favorite Mountain Dew, and it's not easy to find. Go ahead and give that a shot there, Clark. Man. I finished my taco. Oh, I apologize. I'll wash it down with that. Good idea. I'm gonna grab some napkins out of your bag. Two more have, tacos to go for me. I've got literal taco. I'm gonna start drinking it now. Okay, it's going in. I never drunk Mountain Dew before because mom doesn't like me drinking soda, but here I go eating soda. Good thing she's not watching this video. Mmm. Do you like it? Yeah. How's that mixing with the Doritos? Does it taste good? Mm-hmm. Makes it... You should pour some on the taco. Just like pour the Baja Blast onto the taco? Uh-huh. That sounds terrible. Well, just a little bit of it. Just a little? Okay. Mm -hmm. Did you try that with the cheese? Did you dip it in there? No. How does it taste with cheese? See what you think. I'll try my taco. Mm. Good with the cheese, eh? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna try my taco, just a standard issue Taco Bell taco. Feels a little soft at the bottom. It's embarrassing. It's messy. Would I ever if, I was, if I was you, I would buy that. You want to try this? Mm -hmm. This has cheese and lettuce on it. I don't mind lettuce. Try it out at the top. Mm. Cheese and lettuce. You can get yours with cheese and lettuce if you want. Really? 
Yeah, if you'd like it. I just don't want too much lettuce. Well, they definitely pack it with a lot of lettuce. Like it's definitely like, let me see if we can get the focus here. It's, it, oh, I just dropped some. It's definitely a filler material because when you don't get that, you end up with just a little bit of meat, which once again, your tacos, they're kind of like that. You having a second one? Mm -hmm. I figured, there's not much to eat in there. But here's... I need some um, drink bud. Oh, go ahead, go ahead. My mouth is burning. Ah! Here's our second one of these. The Doritos Locos. Man, that is all just like soft down at the bottom. You gotta eat these things like right away, I guess. I just, I just see them right at the bottom at the start. Yeah, don't save these things for leftovers later, folks, because you'll be in trouble. Why? They get real soft. Oh, I'm sorry, I put this over here so you can get it. They Try some more fries. They will get so soft. Ooh, I got a two for one. This is so soft because of the meat. We should start live streaming our lunches. Wouldn't that be kind of funny? Mm -hmm. uh, welcome everyone to lunch. I guess we kind of do that in our Lego channel. Mm -hmm. That's fun. All we do is just review fast food all the time. Mm -hmm. All the new items. Mm -hmm. Maybe my life dream, Clark Moon. Someday, someday. When I make it in YouTube. The cheese they put on here is incredible, man. Mmm. I think the burritos are the best thing at Taco Bell. Especially the quesarito, which hey, is... Hey, Dad, maybe um, next time you can buy one of these and you're allowed to have one. Oh, thank they're you. Pretty, they're really good. I think like perfection level over 9,000. <laughs> Chill, bro. It's the UPS guy. Jeez. Thanks for doing your job. Let us know when people come here. She will murder you if you come here. Look at her. She's ferocious. Very deadly. Anyways, Clark, man. Official review of Taco Bell number two. How'd you like it? It's funny that it's number... No, I'm not going to make that joke. But yeah, that's our Taco Bell lunch review for today. When they come out with a new item, we'll, uh, we'll do another video on there. But we do have Arby's too, so we'll have to check that out. So we're gonna chow this down. Clark has a class after this, and then we'll see where the day takes us. Remember, when Echo is out, you repeat after me. My turn first. H I know, at least. I don't. H hat huh. Your turn. Hmm. Oh. What is it, boss? Oh my gosh. What is it? It's my coffee table. <gasps> Your here. coffee table? My coffee table. I've been waiting for this. The coffee table is here, and our bar stools are here, and other mail and stuff. We've been, it's been going a little crazy lately. Clark Mann's final class of the week starts in about five minutes, but we have a little package here from Walmart. I was thinking about opening it, as long as you're okay with opening this up and then going to class, because there's something inside here that you're really gonna like. Okay. You promise you'll be okay? Uh-huh. You'll still go to class? Uh-huh. Okay, let's do it. I hope my computer doesn't show up I'm like, no, it's time. Go ahead. <gasps> what? What'd you get? The ice transformer. Gale what from um Back to the Future. I wanna open them right now. Yeah, I figured you would. How about I open them up, get them all cut out and set up for you, and then when your class is over, mm -hmm. you can play with it like crazy. Okay. Deal? Uh-huh. I pre-ordered this like four months ago and it just came to us, because I think it came out in January. But this will give me some time to get it set up while you're where's the gorilla? Doing He's on his way, I think. We have one other one. Optim Optimus Primal is coming, and we're yeah. expecting him anytime. But this is Gigawatt from Back to the Future. You're like, come on in the class. I got things to do, lady. I just jumped in. Hey, Clark. It looks like it's just me, Dad. It's just me, Mario. I decided I better take this somewhere else. It may be a little too distracting for Clark, man. Oh, hi, Bear. Oh, I got my helper dog. Hi, helper dog. Oh, boo -boo. <laughs> you're a good girl. Oh, hi, bear. Thank you for your help here. You guys ready for this? There he is. This is the life that I live right here. Could you get any closer? Mm. Your baby bear. There you go. That's what he looks like right there. See how he drives on chocolate labs? There's the instructions here, and I'm gonna see if I can transform this guy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hi. Hi. Hello there. 20 hours later, we have Gigawatt. Looking like a boss. I love that. Did I buy this for me? 
Maybe. But it's also for Clark Man. My sentence says, sorry I'm getting in this shot. So my sentence says, I like cats be because you love cats and mellow cat and they have a little set and um they have a little sentence says i like to pet mellow cat in the picture mellow's going Meow. and i'm playing with her with, and i'm holding a feather and that's me bending down playing with her and and i'm on the deck playing with her because she's an outdoor cat. So, I guess that's all I want to show you. Bye bye! What a cute little ah. nugget. You're done, and I have got a surprise for you in here. <laughs> Look at him transform, dude. How sick is that? That looks like one of the brand new Transformers is coming out. He is brand new. Just came out, I think, this month. Oh, it I... is funny that it says 2020 on it though, and we didn't get it until 2021. 35 years of Back to the Future. We should be in the future right now, Clark Man. Back to the Future. I imagine I'm Doc's robot transforming. That's what it should have done. The transformation actually wasn't too hard either. Like it, it was pretty self-explanatory. One of the easier ones that is we've done. Is this the accessory? Yeah, that's the thing that goes on top of the car when it goes through the the wire that has the lightning bolt hit it. That's how they travel through time at one point. And then he has a gun in the other one. And there's a Mr. Fusion on top of it as well. Um, I kind of want to transform cool. him. How do I transform Back into a car? Uh-huh. Th oh, no! What is that, bro? That's his foot. Okay, we'll make him back into a car again if you want to see what that's like. That was so easy. Transforming him. What do you think of this dude? I like it. Yeah. I thought it was neat. Pew, pew, pew. All right, you play that part. I'll play this part. Yeah, 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 yeah. I still have to go out and get the receiver out of the car and my headphones. I was gonna show you guys that whole process of hooking that up and stuff in this video, but I feel like this has probably gone on long enough for you guys. So when we come back next week, I'll show you on Monday how that whole setup went because I plan to use it this weekend. And the headset, so I'll give you my official review and we'll show you how that is instead of making this video like another 20 minutes longer. Although some of you probably would like that. I try to keep it somewhat manageable here and sometimes it just, we get out of hand with the amount of footage we have. So on that, hope you enjoyed coming along with us this week in Remote Learning Kindergarten, The Adventures of Greg and Clark. We of course love having you. It's fun having these moments and then I'll share this with Clark Man and document it and have it for the future for my video time capsule to look back on these moments of building transformers and eating Taco Bell and buying the things that hopefully make our lives awesome. <laughs> it's it's just, it's cool to have this and it's, uh, it's an honor to be able to do this with you guys. So thank you for watching and we'll see you next week for another adventure. Remote learning kindergarten. You're getting good at this, dude.